product that Joel Lambert wears on his Discovery Channel show and in everyday life. So the first product I'm going to show you is called our Ridgeline Pant. So our Ridgeline Pant is a really great low pro profile tactical pant that it's still really, really durable. So it's made with our Flextec fabric, which is a poly cotton ripstop two-way mechanical stretch. So it's got a lot of great stretch here for incredible range of motion, really, really great durability as well. It's also got a really nice slim fit. Like I mentioned, low profile pockets. It's got knife reinforcements on the pockets here. Also works really well for a cell phone, for a magazine, um, anything that you kind of like to store within easy reach and easy access. An additional two pockets here, pretty deep pockets, great for, for storage of wallets, keys, anything you want in immediate reach. We've also got an additional two pockets back here as well. So a ton of great storage in a really low profile pant package. This is our 511 Ridgeline Pants. The next product is our uh, Skyweight Rapid Dry Boot. So this is built on a platform similar to the really popular Jungle Boot. So it's really, really lightweight. It's also extremely quick drying. Um, which is kind of the rapid dry feature of the boot. It's also compatible with our blood type patch kit. Um, so here you can put, you know, whatever your blood type is for um, emergency medical situations. Um, it's also got a really great tread here. Um, awesome for, for range of motion, really great for, for getting a good grip. Like I mentioned, extremely lightweight, extremely durable, uh, great for, for hot and, and dry situations. And lastly, I'm going to show you our uh, Rush 24 backpack. So our Rush 24 backpack is part of our Rush family, which comes in a 12, a 24, and a 72. So those numbers correlate to the hours of supplies that you can pack in this bag. So our Rush backpacks are really great high durable nylon. Awesome for taking them out, you know, um, abusing them, and they stand up to anything you can throw at them. Um, the great thing is it's got the Molly webbing platform here, so you can attach additional pouches to the front. Also um, applicable with our slipstick um, attachment system as well. So it's got um, a ton of internal organizing pouches. So this is great for a grab bag, you know, something that you need in emergency situations. You can have it stored with everything that you need. You can grab and go. Um, a really great bag product for us as well to be keep, to keep organized. Um, it's also got kind of a yoke construction here, so it distributes away really evenly um, across the shoulders for comfort. Um, and an additional storage back here as well, an additional storage compartment. Uh, so this is the Rush 24 backpack, uh, really popular, um, one of our most pinnacle bags. Um, really great, high durable quality products. I'm Lindsay Grove with 511 Tactical. Thanks for tuning in and finding out about some of the great products that Joel Lambo wears for 511. Daniel Winkler with Winkler Knives, and uh, I've been working with Joel Lambert for, for his uh, TV shows, supplying some of the equipment that he uses, coloring. Uh, we do one axe design and a couple knife designs that have come in handy that he's used on the show and in the field. Uh, the reason being is we make working tools that work well for Joel and, and his applications in uh, evasion and rescue. One item he's doing is the R&D hawk, the front spike hawk. This time off was a, a, a collaborative design that uh, Raphael Kianen with Sayoc Tactical Group developed or, or designed and I worked on the development for it and we also do the manufacturing. It's got a full tapered tang, skeletonized, so it's lightweight, uh, about a pound and a half, but still yet yeah, because we use a 3 8 inch thick high carbon steel and taper the tang, it throws the weight forward in the head to make it very functional. It's got a lot of power in this strike. It works well for Joel because it's lightweight, easy to carry on his kit, but, but then very effective for, for woodcraft chores and combat situations. The two knives that we're working with Joel on uh, are also uh, Sayoc Designs through Raphael Kianen. Uh, this is the Boontok. This knife is a little larger. It's great for, for uh, again, woodcraft. It's also designed to be very effective as a, as a self-defense or combat weapon. The, the blade design and configuration of the handle gives you a lot of, of knowledge without having to look at it where the cutting edge is because it, it drops it down to the knuckle level. The reverse grip position puts it 
to where the blade now is at a 90 degree angle to your body to make it very adaptable to, to combat situations. Uh, also, the, the drop in the blade gives you a lot of power when you're doing woodcraft, such as uh, trimming a sight path or, or cutting limbs or, or doing a shelter. The smaller one is called the Medumi. Uh, also, it's got the same angle set, set up, so it can be used both as a as a, uh, a woodcraft or a camp knife uh, in survival situations. Uh, again, lightweight, the, the steel is tapered from the pommel to the tip. So if this one actually is a little bit more handle heavy. It gives it a very quick feel in the knife blade for, for combat situations, but still it gives you plenty of power for woodcraft. Again, it's got for a reverse grip. It puts the blade at a 90 degree angle to the body, so you have, you're very aware of where the point and the edge are at all times when you use it. So, so these knives are developed with multiple purpose in mind, just as the axe is. Uh, the, the, the primary purpose is a, a, a combat self-defense tool, but in reality they also have a great application in survival and in woodcraft operations. So it's been a pleasure working with Joel. We look forward to keeping it up in the future.